All of us have a direction of our heart. Our hearts are directed towards something or someone. The question is where or what is it pointing towards? Sometimes the direction of our heart can be focused inward. And if, and if it's only focused inward, I'm promising you, and not to discourage you, but just to tell you the truth, it's gonna result in, in being depressed because you're just looking inward. If the direction of our heart is outward, we're looking at media or other people, we're gonna get into the comparison game and it's gonna be frustrating, it's gonna result in being stressed. Uh, but when our hearts are directed upward or Godward, then our lives are gonna be blessed because we have God's perspective. We have his peace, we have his comfort, we trust that he's in control. And so Ezra, he sets his heart not inward towards himself, not outward towards comparison or towards those other things, but upward towards the things of God. And so let's look and let's see where he sets his heart. The first one, we read verse 10 again just for the context. Ezra set his heart, number one, first resolution, to study the law of the Lord. Ezra resolved to internalize the word of God. He resolved in his heart to internalize the word of God, that he didn't just read the word on a surface level reading, but he wanted to read the word and to study the word and to internalize it in such a way that it was in his mind, it was in his heart, it was seeping deep down into his soul. That The resolve of his heart was that the word of God would be internalized. It would get deep into his heart, and man, I believe with all my heart that that's the resolution that we need as we step into 2021, that we need the word of God to seep deep down into our hearts, not a surface level reading of the word, but a deep meditating, a letting God's word impact and influence our lives in such a powerful way. Hey, thanks for watching. To find out more about Houston's First, you can subscribe to our channel or you can go to houstonsfirst.org.